wow. Hmm. Ohanezi President General Obiozo dies at 80. Wow, the man is up to 80. When I first saw this news, I was kind of skeptical. Mm, I didn't bother. But later I saw the governor of Imo State confirming the death of this man. I was like, really? Somebody was even telling me. I said, no, I don't believe that news. And another news from another news outlet say that they should ignore it. And I just said, okay. But not until the until until when the governor of Imo State came out and said, yes, it is true. George Obiozo, the president general of the APS Igbo Social Cultural Group, or Anes Indigo Worldwide, is reportedly dead. Policies Nigeria learned about Obiozo's exit from a highly positioned chieftain of the organization. Obiozo died of a heart related disease on Monday, but he, the APS Igbo body would not announce Obiozo's demise until his family formally makes the announcement. The man is dead, but it is not in our tradition to announce such death, even when we have such information we allow the family members to make such an announcement he died on monday of heart related disease i'm not specific about where he died but he traveled abroad and returned to lagos i was called in the early hours of december 26th that he died in the early hours a highly placed chieftain of oanese said obviously is a nigeria professor and diplomat the 80 year old was a nigeria ambassador to the united states of America. Miss hmm. Gentle Sue, rest in perfect peace. Rest in her. Yeah, why? Rest in hell. Why? Ah, this is this is not nice. This statement is not nice. Miss Gentle Sue, rest in perfect peace. Everybody, if you do good, though, if you do bad, though, it is the it is the debt everybody is owing. Mm -hmm. So it is not matter of a. Uh, whether you did you are we've been hearing that a uh, good people are dying more than even the or they last longer the evil people last longer than the good people so it, that is not something that you use in mocking people or whatever may your soul rest in peace grandpa unfortunately you did not live to witness obi's inauguration <laughs> yeah, they laugh oh. rest in peace professor you said it is the family's responsibility to announce his date why did you anonymously announce it don't mind them please always we to understand before you reply. R.I.P. Papa, how I wish Mr. President had granted your request and released Mazen Nambekano. May the good Lord rest your soul. You have done your best. A refined professor and profound patriot. May his soul rest in peace. May con my condolence to the family Indigo and all peace loving Nigeria. His house was burnt by the same Indigo. Now is dead. He should be buried outside Igbo land since his people burnt his house. What a great loss. May his soul rest in perfect peace. He's a fine gentleman, a great leader. May his soul rest in peace. May his gentle soul rest in perfect peace. As the man's death not been announced through this media publication and it is not even the same announcement that you are expecting from the family or you are expecting a different announcement. George Obiazo was a very fine gentleman, a very refined and learned man may almighty god rest his soul oh death you never have respect for persons rest in peace sir you were loved by your family but god loves you more you have been missed by indigo the entire country and indeed the diplomatic world you have already told the world that obiazo is dead what will be different from what you have said about his death and what the family will still see May could not take this uh, next information easy. May the good Lord grant his soul eternal rest. You were once young and very active. Now you are old and joined your ancestor. Rest on, great man. Chai, the rumor is now confirmed. May his gentle soul rest in peace. Wisdom Park soul rest in perfect peace. It seems to be true that those who don't want Biafra may not live to witness it. Too painful for Indigo, unexpected. My condolences to his family and Igbos. God, they protect also on this month. Because this month eh, is a sorrowful and joyful month. Which so painful for Indigo? What has 10% of Indigo gain from him or his position? Why are you referring him as the man? Very disrespectful since you know. The family has not even made the announcement. Why didn't you 
show respect for them. I pop will be happy now. Why? Mm. May so rest in peace. May God comfort his family and the entire Igbo nation. Is it only fools that inhabit Igbo land? You would wait for the family to announce the misguided elders' demise. Relax and wait for the outcome. May he so rest in peace. His death should serve as a lesson to other leaders of Igbo race not to be betraying their people no matter what no matter what but stand firm as leader to so stand firm as leader okay don't hear <laughs> mm. not the way we know go here hi now wow chai 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 yeah. there's always a mixed reactions in this life some people will like you some people don't like you and if something of this nature happens you begin to see people reacting in different moods which is understandable it is really really understandable oh, well now well, so uh, at least by and large it's been confirmed that uh, this man has joined uh, his ancestors he's joined them he's joined them he's joined them he's so resting perfect speed so people must say something no matter what no matter how you look at it, look at it from a different angle. Whether good or bad. Whether good or bad. May so rest in peace. You have already broadcast it before the family. We told Uzodima that this man was sick. He didn't he didn't want to listen. Nothing good comes to evil from this Abuja governor. Obviously, where was your Ibubagos? Yes. May you so rest in peace. What is time to die? He was not alive. He was not alive to fight the leadership. Is restored in the southeast. May so rest in peace. Oh, my condolences to the family. R.I.P. Obiozo, Professor. <laughs>